Okay, so I'm back today with another wig review for you. And today I'm gonna be showing you something a little bit different that I'm normally used to, but I'm really excited. Um, this week I ordered a couple wigs from Elevate Styles. This is one of them. This is um, Shelly, which I've already showed you, but my old Shelly wig was getting a little raggedy. So I ordered another one and she looks good. Nice and curly how she was when I got the last one so I'm happy about that obviously I'm gonna wear this one out um I haven't picked it out too much I kind of just put it on my head for this video but um I can't wait to break her in like I did the last one now to get to the main event I also ordered another wig her name is called is heaven and here's what her tag looks like now she is a longer wig um, she's made by Free Choice Equal. She has a lace, she's a, it's a lace front, and she has a nice parting, a L shaped part. She can be curled up to 400 degrees, and she comes in a whole bunch of colors. Usually, I stick to a 1B um, to the 2 range. This is the 2, but this time I decided to do something extremely, extremely different, and I got a 99J, which is burgundy. And this is what she looks like on the mannequin head. She's really cute. And uh, yeah, I've never had my real hair or any weave this color. So I'm just like over the moon. But yeah, she has really nice layers. She's thick. You can tell she's shiny, but it's not too shiny. And it's like a really beautiful, like yakky texture. Like it's not very soft I mean, or like silky. So it looks kind of believable. So. Let me go ahead and put this on my head. All I've done so far is cut the lace off and I said I haven't done anything else to her. All right, so I got her on and oh, this is just a beautiful wig. Like, oh my God. It's shedding a little bit, but I honestly think I cut that when I was cutting the lace off because I was not being patient, which you should always do, but it's not a big deal. That's the parting space, which looks a little tight, but you can fix that. Uh, you can tweeze it or you can add a little bit of concealer to it. So I'm going to actually work on the part. And then I'm going to come back and show you. Okay, so I didn't end up tweezing the part at all, but I did add some of my concealer to make it stand out just a little bit more. Um, but I didn't add a lot. And uh, yeah, so basically I'm in love with this wig. I'm probably, ugh, I don't think I'm quite bold enough to start wearing it to work just yet because my hair isn't this color. But I'm going to wear it every day on the weekend and I am probably going to order it in black or 1B because this is just bomb. Like, girl, like it's such a good color. And again, this is 99J. They do have one that's a little bit more red and I think that's like 530 or something. But you can order it. This is a very affordable wig. I think it's actually on sale on Elevate Styles right now. Um, that's why I ordered this one. That's why I ordered the last one. That's where I'm gonna order the next one. Um, let me give you a 360. So yeah, this is just like, I feel very uh, sultry, very uh, Jessica Rabbit or somebody. Like I don't, I don't know, but it's all good. Yeah. Uh, let me talk some more about this wig. Okay, so that's the hairline. My edges are out. I don't really care. Um. I think the part would show better if I had on a like a flesh tone color wig cap, but I don't have on a black one. 
So I might go and get a white one, not a white one, uh, a nude one to make the part look a little bit better. This is a very big head friendly wig. A lot of people said that on YouTube before I bought this and I thought, you know, whatever. They don't know what a big head is because <laughs> I got a big head. But there's a lot of room if it's very comfortable, it's not tight at all. It does have adjustable straps and a couple combs. I know there's one in the back and two up front. So I think you can cut the part and like pull some of your hair out, but I'm natural, so I'm not gonna do that. But yeah, this is like a really uh, big head friendly wig. It's very, it's a very comfortable fit. And if you have a small head, of course you can use the combs and the adjustable straps to make it fit you better. Um, what else? I think the best part about this wig is that it's so thick and it's not shiny. If I had really, really long natural hair and I got a blowout, this is probably exactly what it would look like. So even though it's not my natural hair color, it doesn't look like, you know, something so far from believable. From, yeah, from believable for my head. Um, I can't stop looking at myself in the mirror. Um, what else? That's it. I don't know. I'm so stunned. <sighs> with how good this wig looks. So I'm not gonna, I'm gonna stop talking. I'm gonna do my mandatory two minutes of YouTube modeling and then that's it. Um, if you want more details about this wig, please check out my description bar and my blog. I'm gonna put up more pictures and an in-depth review of this. This is just my first, um, my initial reaction, but I'm gonna wear it for a couple days and then let you know how it holds up. But thank you for watching and please share if you like this video.